The reunion. He left his buffalo outside and walked into the local community center. He said, "Hello. We would like to throw a party here tomorrow. How much is it to rent the venue?" The elder said, "I'm sorry, but this is a local community center. Generally, we do not let people rent it for celebrations." People come here sometimes to pray for the harvest and have some food together, but never to party. Yes, yes," said T. "But you have weddings, don't you? Isn't that a celebration?" "Yes, but not wedding parties. Weddings are serious occasions where relatives and guests come to pray for good luck for the married couple." The elder folded his arms. There are only a few exceptions, like for festivals or fireworks. But tomorrow is the national holiday for children, begged T. Although we are not having any big ceremony, it still counts as an exception, right? The elder thought for a moment. So, have you got any budget for the place? Yes. We asked our parents for it. Is ten sacks of rice a good enough of an offering? Ten sacks! <laughs> the elder coughed. If then, I warmly welcome all of you. You are so thoughtful. Excellent. T gave the sign for his friend to bring in sacks of rice. Now my friend's loved ones are big, expensive cars. Where can we park them? Anywhere," said the elder, while counting the sacks of finest rice. "Please feel at home and good luck." T smiled. Fantastic. Two days later, the elder found many huge, brown, smelly things on the pavement around his beautiful community center. He called T. "What did you do to my place?" It smells terrible. Oh, I didn't tell you we were having a buffalo show. <laughs>